Hello, my name is Tori and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have another Nendoroid unboxing that I wanted to share with you and that is Echidna from ReZero. I am a huge ReZero fan. We already have Rem, Ram and Amelia Nendoroids so I cannot wait to add Echidna to the collection. Don't have Subaru though, but I do have Beatrice on uh, pre-order. So hopefully we can add her to the collection and then get Subaru in the future. I didn't get him when he came out because I didn't have Rem and Ram at the time. Um, and yeah, big regrets there. Just before I get into the Nendoroid unboxing, I actually wanted to share this prize figure with you. This is Magician Rem. She's absolutely gorgeous. She's got this little top hat on, this little cane. She's got this really beautiful outfit on, sort of a, I don't know what you'd call this, like a waistcoated type thing with the tails. She's got her stockings and boots. And she's also got this really, really nice base, as prize figures often do, with the stars and the purple. And it says, ReZero, starting life for another world. But yeah, I haven't done an unboxing of her because she was actually a gift from me to my fiance for his birthday. So he unboxed her himself, obviously on his birthday. But to be honest with you, it was a present for him and for me because I think she's really beautiful and I really wanted her too. So it was win-win for me, but yeah, she's really gorgeous. She's, for her price, she looks really good. I mean, she was around 25, 30 pounds, I think. You know, her paintwork isn't perfect, but as far as prize figures goes, I really, really like her. I think she's really nice. So I'm very happy with her, but I just wanted to share her with you because I couldn't do an unboxing. But with the theme of ReZero, I thought, let's share some more Rem love. But let's get over to the actual Nendoroid unboxing. Okay, so to the Echidna Nendoroid unboxing. Um, her box is pretty plain. There's not that much excitement going on to it. She's got sort of the black sides and the white top with the purple, which is nice, keeping with the theme of her character. Um, but other than that, it's just got pictures, really, of her different poses on the side whoops as i was saying the sides and the top and the bottom just have pictures as all in the row boxes do of her different poses okay so in her box we have the instructions um, I will do a little inventory check later to make sure all her pieces are here. If you saw my last Nendoro uh, video I was missing a part so I will now start to check the pieces so I will put that aside somewhere safe we have in her box, we've got herself, obviously, two extra face plates, so three face plates in total. We have her chair to do her little tea party with, her cup and saucer as well, a few um, replacement hands. Then we have, oh, her hand and a book, and then her seated down uh, bottom half as well, so we can put her in the chair. Again, we don't have two levels with this. We just have a little baggie on the back, but this doesn't actually have any extra parts in it. This just appears to have her stand and the peg thing to stand her up on. She smells really good. Is that weird? Okay, so I'm going to take her mountains of plastic off. To reveal her face. I wasn't sure how I felt about her actually, um, and I hadn't pre-ordered her. Um, from part one of season two but watching part two of season two um, I absolutely loved her and I was so happy when I went online and found out that she was still available and actually I think she'd come out a few days before I ordered her and she was still in stock so I was so pleased about that oh my gosh she is really beautiful her dress is gorgeous, her face is perfect, her little butterfly hair clip thingy is really, really nice. I quite like it actually, the, the butterfly is quite shiny, but she's quite matte. Um, I don't know if you can see that, you can probably see it better when I do some close-ups in a little while, but yeah, I really like that kind of comparison, that's really sweet. Her chair is really cute as well, to go with her... Um, tea set. It's a shame you don't get a table with it. Her face plates are really cute. They're sort of these little concerned expressions. I like those a lot. We've got her seated down pose, which I think I'll probably use actually, because I think that'll be really cute. Let me just cut her in half. 
I really like her on a chair. I think I'll display her on a chair. You won't need a the stand or the base for her to be displayed. Actually, I don't think you would need the base at all, really, because her skirt is so flared that she stood on her own anyway, quite sturdily. So I don't think the base is necessary on this dendroid, which is nice. And then, of course, as I said before, we have these extra pieces in here and we can do her with her tea set. Let me just put her with her tea set quickly because I think that'll be cute. But her hair is huge. I think I'm going to have to decapitate her to do her hands. Many sorry, many apologies, Miss, for beheading you. Oh gosh, her her actual um saucer for her cup actually isn't attached to the hand. Oh gosh, I feel like that would not take very much to just knock it out. <laughs> God, I hope that isn't. I hope that doesn't come off and get hoovered up or something. Anyway. <laughs> oh risky but there we go oh gosh her cup is the same oh oh this is a fiddly one i don't know oh i don't know why the cup is not just part of the hand i mean i think once you get her together she probably will be fine i'm just a bit concerned like if you accidentally knock her I don't realize the cup comes off and you know does get sucked up into the hoover but I've just noticed anyway I've kind of got her in a pose I'm not going to fiddle with her anymore I think I need to sort of sit down and see if I can get this cup and saucer to stay in her hands properly um but we shall see anyway I'm going to do some close-up shots now so you can see her properly in her full glory and uh yeah let's take a look at those my echidna witch of greed nendoroid unboxing from ReZero. if you enjoyed the video please give me a thumbs up if you like ReZero, let me know down in the comments and if you like unboxing videos please subscribe if you'd like to see some more in the future anyway thank you for watching bye